Hey guys, Prince of Macedon here. Gonna do a live commentary battle for Total War Warhammer. And I'll be using the dwarves. Now, I told you guys I played against a really good dwarf player. I cannot find that replay for some reason. But from what I remember, he he had an artillery piece, and I think he had a ballistics expert, which helped him increase his accuracy with his artillery. So I'm gonna try that. Ooh, he's gonna be playing with a Bretonia, it looks like. If he's gonna be Bretonia, I'm gonna change up my lineup here. Oh, and now he went to the vampire counts. Very nice. Is it? No, that's not very nice. I have some Thunderers, but that's not gonna stop this guy from spirit leeching me, or whatever he's gonna use to get me. The rest of my armor looks pretty decent, though. I mean, I can use, try to use my accuracy to knock out his uh, vampires, his vampire heroes and Manfred, if he's going with that build. But this is a non-ladder battle, so maybe this guy's not going to use the Manfred plus vampire 1, vampire 2 combination. But I don't think I've ever used this ballistic specialist. If I have, I don't remember doing it well. Uh, none. I like to practice with no rules on this game because when I play on ladder, there are no rules on ladder, so I want these guys to use whatever they want. It's better uh, better practice. And again, I am not a dwarf specialist. My my faction of choice is the Empire, but people want to see the dwarf succeed, and I, I want to see a good dwarf lineup. Like, I, I never lose to the dwarves when I'm using the Empire, so I'm always hoping someone can take me out with the dwarves so I, I can learn from their dwarf composition. But the search continues, and while the search continues, I'm going to try my own uh, experimental compositions with the dwarves. But hopefully we can kill some... some vampires. And again, I don't advocate bringing artillery for the dwarves. You might think it's a natural thing to do. Unfortunately, on ladder settings, these artillery pieces are kind of useless. Maybe in, in a huge Ultra Funds battle, they'll be more acceptable. And not much of a cost drain on your budget, but here they are. In order to make them succeed, you need your first few shots to kill opponents. But if you're not killing opponents like enemy units, then you're not really having a cost-effective unit there. If I could even trade one of my artillery pieces for one whole unit of his, I'll be happy with that. That'll be cost-effective. I think these are cannons are like 800? 800? 800 or something. So if I can kill a unit of that of equal value, that would be a cost-effective trade. So we'll see what happens here. Good luck, have fun, my friend. So it's gonna take a while for us to connect. I have patience though. I definitely want to try this setup here, and I definitely want to see if I can make this uh, ballistics expert work. Alright, I think we're about to spawn in together here. Come on now. Let's see how big his army is. 1072, mine's 773. Kind of expect that when I bring artillery though, because artillery only counts for three, three, three units, plus my heroes too. So let's see here, what's a good place? I don't want that building blocking my view, so maybe right here. Let's spread them out a tiny bit. Not too much though. I want my ballistics expert to be able to be in the middle of them using his spells. His abilities to make them better range and faster ammo reload. So I'm pretty sure this guy's gonna try to snipe. Lord snipe me. We'll see. I'll leave these thunderers in the back. You know what? Maybe I'll hide one. No, no, that's, that's fine. I'll leave my slayer towards the back too. You too, mate. For the High King! 
Oh, he's got flying units. What do we got? That is... That's not Manfred, is it? That's not. But he does have another... He does have a vampire unit right here, though. See that? That girl? She can do the Bajuna, or Bajuna, plus uh, Spirit Leech. This guy, I can't tell if that's... I don't think that's Manfred. I don't think so. Anyway, since he's using the uh, the vampires, I'll let him come to me. So let's see how much my range increases when I hit the uh, this thing. Wait a minute, am I missing a? I don't, I don't know. What I, do. I thought there was something that increases the range. Guess not. That's weird. Or maybe it's automatically doing it. I don't know. When he gets in range, I'm going to. Here we go. I feel like I was too far. He's he's ducking and weaving my guys right now. Maybe I'll hit these guys. The far guys. Ooh, direct hit! He's gonna come against my Thunderers very soon. What's point blank range, uh, his wizard here? There we go. Cross streamers, my friend. There he goes, casting his freaking Bayuna. Or sorry, Spirit Leech. But hey, I said no, no, no uh, rules, so whatever. Oh, he's going for, for a dive here. Let's go take him out. Let's bring my commander over here, take out his far guys. He's completely... BAM! Popped! Where's this freaking vampire? There she is. Target that freaking hag back over there. Crap. Here she comes. Oh, that was a dumb spell. What a waste. Let's shoot her to hell. Come on, guys. Plow her. There we go. Just casting that... I don't know. It's not doing anything to my guys. Oh, she's not casting it on my, my hero there. Oh, nailed her. Suck it, she-witch. Crap, I was not watching this part. Where are my slayers at? They slayers. I need my slayers over on this side. I'm so glad I killed that freaking vampire. Where'd 
Where's my? There she is. Here's an update on the uh, results here. So I'm 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 nailing this guy from the side with with my uh, thunderers here. Let's get this Slayer over here. Oh, look at look at his freaking vampire commander. One more shot would waste that guy. Popped. Aye, that, that, that guy bypassed my dudes over here. What's setting up my commander over here to get him? Oh man, he's getting knocked down by something. He's about to get slayed, that's, that's for sure. Oh, I won this battle! Suck it, dude! Actually, good game, sorry. Quite happy without my friends. Oh, man! <laughs> yeah! Sweet. Alright. One, six, six. There you go! I'll have to try that setup on, uh... Oh, that was Manfred! Yeah, but I'll have to try that setup on Ladder. I'm so glad I wiped out his vampire at the start. That was funny. But yeah, good get to him, though. And I hope you enjoyed this battle!